Howdy folks, it's Senal Sergeant. Today we're gonna to be playing some Fargon. So if you're wondering what Fargon is, think Stalker with a poly kind of feel. So if you played Dead Poly, played Surround Dead, you know, that kind of a poly type feel, then you're probably gonna enjoy the look of what Fargon is. Now, please don't mistake that, that, that it's like those two games because it's not. It's a lot of NPC interactions. There, there's factions. You've got a living, a breathing world. A lot of dynamic events that you're gonna be out doing. And of course, zombies. You're gonna be crafting in this game. You're gonna be building. You're going to be getting missions and quests and stuff like that that you're going to have to do. So it's a lot of fun. It is difficult. So I can tell you that now it is early access. So it's still being developed on currently uh, $15.99 on Steam early access with bugs. I've seen a couple bugs here and there, some inventory issues and things like that. Developers been amazing thus far. Lots of updates have been happening. Uh, very interactive on the Discord. Got a kind of a smaller Discord right now, but I, I don't think it'll take long for this game to blow up. Uh, as always, if you have any questions or anything else, post them down below. I'll be happy to answer about it. Let's get into it. So let's go in and make our first character I have played just a little bit, but not enough to really know what I'm doing. So that's the good news. Okay, we got male, female, neutral. You've got all, there, there's a there's a decent amount of stuff. So you can be choosing, uh, you know, clean cut. We're gonna go with the full on. I, I hope they add a little bit more, you know, colors, things like that. I think that would be pretty good. You know, we've got a full on beard, so we're gonna go with this right here. We've got permadeath. So once characters, you know, dies, then they're basically deleted or hardcore start. Because I cheated and I played just a little bit, probably had a good uh, five minutes, 10 minutes of playing. We're gonna do a hardcore start just because I know you guys are gonna appreciate that. Let's go ahead and get this puppy started. Okay, here we go. Learning the ropes. Speak to Sal at the bus at the end of the village to learn about opportunities within the barrens. Okay, we've got money. We're going to get from this. We're going to get some XP and we're also going to get some coffee. Provides a large boost to thirst and temporarily boost your stamina. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, so WASD, shift to sprint. That's pretty easy. I do know Jay kind of pulls up PDA. So again, this is kind of that stalker feel. So I, I enjoyed this one. You've also got a map. So this is kind of the size of the map right now. You can scroll in and you can go out, but it's not gonna show you where you are actually on the map. So I I don't even know, what was the name of this place? Hopefully you tell me the name of this place because I'm not really sure where we are right now. We're just gonna be running around endlessly trying to find our way to, to where we need to go. Uh, you do have, you know, with your Q and E, you can kind of look around. We don't have anything on us right now. So we're kind of, you know, in a bad way, <laughs> but, but that's okay. All right, let's go in some of these buildings. Let's see if we can find anything. I'll talk you through a couple things. So F to kind of search loot off feature. Pretty good. One thing I have noticed about the game. So like that water bottle right there, if I wanted to pick it up or, or if it was actually something I could pick up, you got to move it around because there's not a dot in the middle of the screen. So I've noticed that I've ran by stuff that's been on the ground that I didn't know I could pick up because when I looked at it, you know, it, it didn't highlight or anything. And I don't know, like it's, you guys will see, don't worry. I'm sure in this episode, I'm going to look at something. Or I'm going to find something I want to look at and do it. Hey, hey, what are you boys doing here? What's going on? You guys look awful sad, man. You guys. Okay, here's a question. Why do three. Do I have a mask on? Is this like a nuclear zone or something? Why you guys got uh, this is gas, gas, gas. What's happening? And why are you stuck on this tent over here? Okay, so we can interact with this fire. What can we do here? Oh, okay, here's the recipes that we got and drinks. Oh, you. Okay, so you can just separate them. So we can do cooked meat. Okay, then it's got requirements. Okay, that's good. So you got cooked meat, requirements, meat uncooked. This has got chili plant water. That's rice and water. Okay. Okay, well, I hope you enjoy that tent. That you're like face punching. I'm not sure why you're doing that. Okay. And those are the little bugs you're going to see. It's definitely nothing thus far that's like made the game not enjoyable. Oh, we got some pills there. What was that? I for inventory, just so everybody knows. So we got some nine mil rounds. We got a rice packet. Oh, this stuff's on the ground. I'm glad I did that, man. I didn't even know there was stuff on the ground. See, you see what I'm, see what I'm talking about? I didn't even know there was something on the ground. Okay, we got some painkillers. I'm guessing we'll probably want that. Okay, and we've got stuff over here to the right, too. So we got headgear, face armor, clothes, and backpack. Our current armor is only one. We got primary, secondary. We've got wellness, infected, and toxicity. Okay, we got crafting that we're going to be able to do. We're going to get into some of this stuff later. I, I don't want to show off too much of it right now who's this guy aha sal haven't seen you around here before well that's because i ain't been here before so i'm guessing what we want to do is we want to do this i hear you run things around here run things ha not at all but when you're the guy that holds the guns people tend to listen to you and yeah, that's that's a true statement listen i'm not sure what you're doing out here let me give you some advice. Make some friends and get yourself a nice camp set up. I may not like anyone, but people like me. And that sure helps when the dead come a knocking. Uh, I'll tell you what, talk to me again. You can do a job, camping part to help you get started. And here's a coffee on the house. 
That's what I'm talking about. It better be good coffee, man. You got Starbucks? What do you got? So I think we're supposed to talk to him again. You said you had a job. Okay, yep. I did it. We're not going to read this stuff. We, we know what we're doing, Sal. Sal wants me to talk to a man named Enver. Apparently, a group of runners has gone missing, and I am to investigate the situation. Enver can be found near the entrance to the runner's village. Okay, we're going to get money, XP. We're going to get rep, runner, plus, plus. Portable storage. What is that? Green juice and nine mil rounds. Now, these are the crafting tables. So, for a weapon table, so we can upgrade. If, if we had a weapon, I could show you. But these are the, these are the stuff you're going to be wanting to look for when you're out and about. That, that system looks like it's actually pretty cool. Haven't had a chance to actually use it yet, but I'm sure we will uh, at some point get to use it. Is there anything over here? That's how I jump. When I jump, I yell. Oh, there we go. What do you got in here? I want to know who's hiding stuff. Oh, there we go. Bam! We got our first. Is there durability on this thing? There is. Condition 38. Oh, boy. Oh, the other thing I want to look real quick just because we need something secondary. So we need a wooden plank and scraps too. I think we have enough, right? Okay, so here's a wooden plank. We need twigs times two. Can I craft that? I can. So it used the, the sticks down here. Do I have enough to do this? I don't think I have enough to do that. I do not. I don't know what scraps it says. It just says scraps times two. Oh, that, that stuff right there. Used in crafting recipes. Dismantling items as well as found in the world. Oh, we can dismantle something? Well, we can't do anything yet. I got an axe in my hand. I promise I'm not going to cut you. If you're looking to get with the runners, could always be good people around here. All right, let's see. I'm missing runners. Need help with anything. Let's go with this. So I found someone to help. I would go myself, but with affected getting closer every day, I am needed here. Got to tip some supplies to the compound north of here. Sent a group of runners to check it out. This should have been a quick scouting mission, but they haven't gotten back. Oh boy. Okay, so this is this is bad already. Need something? Yes, we want the other thing too. A package ran down to my brother. He runs a farm down in the grasslands. Okay, so we're going to a farm, and they're going to compensate me with a campfire and cleaning lubricant. All right, let's go ahead and accept that too. What is that? Okay, PDA. I matched the inwind looking to make some good money and loot. As you may have noticed, there are several locked bunkers scattered around the barrens. These secret facilities contain locked crates that require special attention to unlock. Bring them back to any of the bunker masters and the barrens to crack them open. Oh, and should you find any of the key cards to access these bunkers, the bunker masters can also help decode them to allow you to actually use them. Happy hunting. Okay, that is some good tips. Is there anything in here? There's some dirty underwear in here. Come on, guys. All right, we'll see you guys later. Okay, first thing we need to do is figure out where we're going. Let's not get crazy here. Okay, we're going to go to... Let's go to this one. Let's deliver the parcel to Harbor. Oh, Jay again. There we go. And I see the marker up on the top. So we've got us a little orange and white. And to make a crappy day already crappier, we have the largest rainstorm ever with some of the largest raindrops dropping on us so we're in a zombie apocalypse we're in a gas mask if if i'm like the rest of them and now it's raining let's see what kind of problems we're gonna have when we go in here and we chop somebody in half hopefully the zombies are okay we're gonna sneak up just a little bit we'll do a little low crawling in here i don't like the the sun's going down a little freaky oh there's some sort of building here oh boy somebody's in here breathing Maybe we can go around this fence here and then come around the backside and just chop this dude in the nugget. Give him the one, two, one, two. Oh, I'll see. Yeah, what's up? I killed him so hard he burped when he died. Okay, that guy's good. Let's see if there's any more out here. Oh, there's a lady. Now, can you sneak up on him? Yeah, get get wrecked. Straighten the knees. <laughs> I was breaking that lady's legs. Oh, okay, we got some... Oh, luggage. Okay, what do we have in here? Got, got a little soda. Got a little Snickers bar. Just in case you're hangry. Make sure you got one of those. That way you're, you know, good to go. Here, let me go over here. Pop this puppy in there. Oh, there's another shirt. What's the difference between those two shirts? 
This one, this one is a mechanics overalls. Oh, that's pretty cool. Wonder outfit does not offer much protection. So that's point two armor. Yeah, they're both the same. Okay. Wait, can I can I break that apart or something? So I right click it. What happens if I destroy it? This is scary, but I'm gonna do it. <gasps> it didn't do anything that I thought it was gonna do. Or did it? Nope, it didn't. Yeesh. Okay. Well, one trial learning. You probably don't want to break things like that or, or destroy. I thought maybe that's what you needed to do. What is this lady? Get! Get! Okay, she's no longer with us. Okay, let's take that. Okay, can't get in that wall locker. There's a TV. Is that a VCR? This game's so 1980s. It's getting a little dark. I guess I can't sleep unless there's a bed of some sort. Wait, hold on. There's a hole in that wall. All right, there we go. There we go. What do we got in here? Oh, we got a hat. Okay, what's in here? Nothing there. Can't sleep in there. Okay, this is probably going to suck. Okay, we got him. We got him. Oh, that's exactly what we needed. We did get hurt on that one. Uh, yep, we're bleeding a little bit. So do I have any bandages? Can I craft a bandage? Oh, there's a bandage right there. Insufficient ingredients. Of course there's insufficient ingredients. Wow. So here I am. Oh, there's there's a bandage right there. Maybe I don't need it. Uh, no, no, we're bleeding. We definitely bleeding out. Yeah, let's go ahead and put that on. Okay. Now, am I bleeding still? Nope, we stopped bleeding. Perfect. Okay, how do I get in here? See if there's any. Oh, what is this stuff over here? Yeah, you see what I'm talking about? So it. And just think if it's a smaller item, it's going to be even harder to kind of know if you can pick it up or not. So that's the only thing I would just spend a little bit of time on that to have a little bit bigger of an area here. What is this? Oh, I can't go out that way. There's nothing else in here. I did check cars earlier, just so you know, but I didn't see anything in the cars. So that's why I'm not checking them. All right, off to his uncles or brothers or sister or whatever. I, which one was it? I'm going over to, uh, to Harbor. So we're going to deliver this parcel real quick. Get that over with. All right, we're coming up on uh, the next area. Now oh, here's a zombie right here. You just, yeah, you got to hell marry him, man. You got to run up and just like give him the what for. You can't be can't be bull crapping that's for sure Let's see if we can sneak up behind this guy i don't even know how much i have left in this axe i hear shooting over there really dude how did you hit me and first off dag nab it all right hold on we losing blood no we're not okay i'm pretty good right now oh my gosh look at him there's two more over there Ugh. We're going to try to stay away from those dudes. If I had a gun or something. Probably be a little bit different, but here we are running around out here naked. Got a t-shirt on and a pair of boxers and an axe. Oh boy. I can hear somebody over there. Is there anything in here? No. Guess not. Oh, great. Come on. Come on. Shut it. Hell married. I think that was a gun. Was that a gun? That was a stick. Let's see what's over here. Oh. Got some barrels. Okay. What's this one? More barrel. Oh, we got a hot tamale. Ooh. Oh, here goes. Okay, here's a briefcase. Or luggage. Okay, we got electrical scrap. Five, five, six rounds. Good to go. Yeah, you know what? Let's move to this. I think this is Harvard's place, if I remember right. Yep, Harvard's farm. I also want to try to find this on the map. Better not be looking to start trouble. Man, I'm not looking to start trouble, bro. I got a package here from your brother. In fact, I ought to kick this package because you're talking smack to me. Package full explosive. I guess what? You'll drop it off. Yes, I will. What'd you give me? Need something? Yeah, well, I need this other thing. You seem on the edge. 
and having issues with bandits. Oh, of course, those stupid bandits, man. Even took my two sons for ransom. Now I won't lie. They aren't exactly worth much, but they are my blood. Oh my gosh. Look at someone isn't afraid of a little firefight. Well, if I had a gun, I probably would not be afraid of a firefight. But let me just be honest. I, all I got right now, the only guns I got are from my biceps. So I don't know if they're... Oh, what is this? Hey, I, you don't think he minds that I'm in here, like, taking all his ammo and all this stuff from his from his house? <laughs> I wonder if I could sell it back to him. Can I Can I sell it back to him? Where'd he go? I hear him back here. Hey, what's up, bro? Can I sell this back to you? Oh, my gosh. This is going to be phenomenal. Yep, I could sell I could sell him his own stuff. I don't think I want to sell the nine mil rounds. That seems a little bit silly. I don't know what to sell here. Okay, we'll sell that shirt. Wow. What about a zombie arm, man? Okay, even zombie arms are a little bit. Dang, man, that dude. I don't, I don't want to know what he's doing with the zombie arms. Seven, six, two rounds. How many is it? Six. Six of them? That's it? Oh, come on, man. Wow. Rice packet six. We're going to keep that. We got 50 cow rounds. Now, I could keep those. But I think we'll sell them because we need more money than anything. Gun cleaning, lubricant, we'll keep. Campfire, we'll keep. Canned beans. All of this stuff seems like stuff that I want to keep. Okay, I think that's pretty good for now. Let's not get crazy with doing it. So we made a little bit of money. Let's buy some water from them. Let's buy a steak. Got some coffee beans. We'll take two of those. Green juice. Oh, man. Look how much money this is costing already. Holy crap, man. A daggum apples. 18 credits. Jeez. Okay. Let's just leave it at that. We're not, Now we're basically broke. And I still have no gun. This is phenomenal. I close this door. What's in here? Okay, good. Well, we're going to take a nap. Let's go nighty night. Somebody sing to me. Okay, so we can do for hours. Let's go seven hours. You need at least... What is it? Really should have gone like eight hours. I didn't see a time. Was there a time on the thing? I should have been paying attention to that. I probably would have been a good thing to know. We're down here. What is this right here? Yeah, there's something right here. All right, so we definitely went the right direction here. Coming up on what I believe is going to be... What was that? What was that called? Dead Days and Bar. So good, good place to get us a little something to... You know, sip on. Kick our feet back. We got the sun coming up. So you can see our shadow kind of coming over here to the left. I don't know what this place is. So, you know, things could go bad quickly. And that would be okay. I mean, this place does look like it's a lockdown fortress. Oh, yeah. One thing I just noticed. Look down in the bottom left. What, what did I tell you guys? So we'd be having some problems. So we're going to use this. I don't know how much this is going to help us, though. Oh, that, that didn't do bad. All right, let's get us a water. Probably going to have to do, what do you think, one or two waters? Okay, one water did pretty good. I don't think I want to eat. Oh, here, let me eat this. Let me eat that, uh, that steak. The steak that looks like a granola bar. There we go. Okay, that's perfect right there. So let me go in here. I don't know what to expect in here. So it looks like it's a survivor camp of some sort. Can we make this our home? Oh, you you just like randomly out here, bro? <laughs> this, this guy's just like randomly sitting out here. What can we get you, stranger? I don't know yet. Let's see what we're doing. Let's... uh. Looking for work. Actually, you have a sort of thing going on. Listen, you know those husk, the green glowy guys that kill most people who get close. I haven't seen those dudes yet, man. Why are you telling me the lore? And I haven't even seen them. I need you to close them a bunch, actually. A group of them have stumbled into my lumber camp and for whatever reason haven't left. Oh, did you look for my lumberjack? Why are you out? Oh my gosh. Bro, you guys understand that all I have is an ax on me, right? These guys are killing me. Okay, let me see if I can sell some of this stuff. Looking for a drink or some ammo. Oh, wow. This guy's got all kinds of stuff here. Oh, right there. That's what I need. So, okay. So, what? It, what is this? A PM5? Ammo types, 9 mil. You can do a pistol. Oh, right there. A hunting rifle. How much is that? 765? And that's 7.62 rounds. 
I think I got rid of the 762 rounds, unfortunately. This is 556 five, rounds, though. How many of those do we have? So we've got 19 of those. We got 33. We may have no choice but to get the, uh, the pistol after I sell some of this stuff. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to have any other choice here. What is this, 760? Oh, we got, we got four. What? We got that. What is this? Protein bar we're going to keep. We're going to keep the bandage. Never know when you're going to need that. So I think what we do, I hate to do this, but we get rid of it because we need better items. We'll get rid of that knife. We're not going to do anything with that. Let's get rid of some of those. Coffee we're going to keep. Water we definitely need to keep. 28 credits. Is that enough? That ain't even enough, is it? Oh my gosh. Yeah, we're in a bad way right now. Well, I guess we just keep we just keep struggling. We're all, we'll put ourselves in a struggle bus. Okay, what else do we have here? So there's day ends right there. What is this over here? And there's something back here too. So I think we just keep going northeast here. There's something across the water over there. Should be something over here we're going to run into. There it is. What's that right there? Oh. Okay. What's up, dude? That dude right there is just doing... He's just spinning. Look at him. <laughs> yeah, you got it. You got the, got the whisker biscuit. Okay, we got him. What is this dude? What? What? Holy crap, I aggro too many. Oh, we got them. Come on. Oh, boy. Really? Oh, jeez. Oh, we had a little bit too much there, but I think we, uh, I think we actually did. Okay. Definitely a little bit too many of those cats running at us all at the same time. And they really even give us that much stuff. I mean, you guys could have been carrying a little bit more in your pockets. You know what I mean? I'm not bleeding out. I don't think. Okay. There is a building here. Road construction. Oh, they were building a road. How about we go inside this place for, oh, medical. Nice. Hey, what is that? Morphine. Okay. We'll take some of that morphine for sure. Got a wrench. Dude. We got whatever this is. Oh, a walleye. What? We finally got it. Okay, so we got this little backpack. Right? Noise. So where does that give us? Does it give us more carry capacity? Seven more. Okay. Let's put that little helmet on. And then we're going to put this on instead of what we got on right now. Because it gives us a little bit more armor. Nice. Also want to put this hat on. Where we look like a trucker. So let's put, let's just put both of these on just in case. This one's still 36, so it's not doing bad. It's not like I have to have it yet, but should be another little location. Okay, so we have another objective here. Clear out the husks, which that doesn't sound safe at all. Oh, I see bandits up there. Oh, there's dudes up there. Come on down. Can you guys get down there? Yeah. Dude, this axe is pretty good. Oh, we got a pistol, man. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Okay, what do we have here? Okay, so now we can do a little swapping. So how about if we take this pistola, right? Throw that over here. Hold number two out real quick. Now, what I don't know, there's some lights down there. So I'm wondering if there's bad guys down there. Yeah. You see what I mean? Right there. There's something there. I can't. Wish I had a sniper rifle or something. And and the other thing is I can't really tell what the how do you know if they're friendly or enemy? There's so many, man. There's like four of these cats. How about if we run up a little bit and see? Oh, 
Holy crap, yeah. dude. Woo. Woo. Okay. Oh. Okay. We definitely made the wrong decision here. Okay. All right. Hey, I'm here to make friends. We, we don't need to do this. We don't need to do this. Oh my gosh. There's so many of them. Okay. We, uh, <laughs> we may not have made the best choice here. This may not have been what we were supposed to do. Just run. Just run. Don't look back. Sometimes it's the right thing to do, right? It's just, just run. I don't know if I can make it over here to this base because that was way too much. There's way too many of them. And hopefully they don't know how to get into this base. Oh my. Well, I think that that's a pretty good kind of first look at this. We saw a couple of different areas, different types of zombies. We definitely ran into a, to a hot mess of just craziness there. I, I do like the poly type games. So I think that, you know, the direction that the game is going right now is, is good. Lots of questing in it. I think that's kind of the second thing that I enjoy about games like this is that you have missions and things that you're doing, you know, kind of the way that you pull the PDA and then you have these different types of missions that you're going to be doing, whether it's, you know, locating compounds, killing bandits, you know, whatever the case may be, all of that type of stuff is good. So it's very PVE heavy, not a PVP based game, which is, which is perfectly fine. I'm enjoying the, the gunplay actually is surprisingly pretty good. I don't know what it's going to be like with a rifle. And, and again, we're still early game. So there's, there's lots of things to actually do inside of the game and weapons I'm sure to actually get. And it's a little bit newer. So there's probably weapons that are going to be getting added. I know there was a couple that were added the other day. So I think we'll have a bit, but I do like the gunplay. It's a little bit harder. You know, it's not as easy to, to, to shoot in like some other games, which to me is actually kind of a uh, breath of fresh air, you know, make, make it a little bit more difficult because it is a little bit more difficult to, uh, to actually shoot. Now, some of the cons, some of the things that you need to do, if, if you are somebody who plays early access games and you don't like games that have bugs, I, I would tell you to just wait a little bit longer, you know, give the developer another maybe six months or so to really get this game where it needs to be, where there's not as many, you know, bugs and stuff. And I think that you're going to enjoy the game much better because there are bugs. I got caught inside of my inventory uh, on one of the, the playthroughs. And then I basically had to go out of the game and then come back into it. Uh, with the zombies, I, I do think, you know, you guys saw me fighting some of the zombies. I think there's a satisfaction piece here. I mean, I've never been hit in the head with a, uh, you know, with an ax before, but I do think that, you know, it would probably hurt uh, and it would probably stun them. And I don't think it would take as many hits as it is. So I, I do think that there needs to be a little bit more look on the zombies. And I think that the developer is going to be working on that to kind of bring that into, into tune. Hope you guys enjoyed watching me just get face punched a couple of times. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, make sure you hit the like button and uh, we'll see you guys on the next one. This is CNL Sarge signing off. Thank you.